the rep lock then. Sure, what's going on? So, if our starting in pipe works, and of course, our vigil starting in docking bay. So we're going to see a 221. One guy building a base, two gravity, two repair for the victory. We're going to see possibly a four man push. We're going to see a gorge in the alternation as well. Gorge comes out, very risky, he should be getting his hydras up. Not sure what he's doing there. But I guess he wants to keep his skull alive, it's not bad at it. Now he's not in the Zero muscle does go down, Gorge all on his own, he's going to need some backup. Um, looks like it's gonna retreat. Wait for some, some to help. Uh, in the meantime, we've got Soma just harassing uh, no name here. No parasite on the ground. And uh, maybe he did a pretty good job of uh, pushing the alien back right now. Put a lot of pressure on. So we've got uh, three RTs up for the moment for Overtree. One in pub, one in repair, on the main base. And at the moment, just the one with the one being built in organ donation for uh, and fire. And still no hydras in oxygenation, strangely. That could really help them if they start to push in. Uh, gravity, which is uh, a bit of a death trap for the aliens, but they do have a gorge so they have, they have two marines now. Here we go. Let's see what Ovid can do. They're a bit split up, so probably not much right now. Uh, although, the aliens are quite low. Is, oh, okay. It's gorging up uh, just outside security units. Don't often see that. So yeah, that's uh, that's going to be the, that area secure for a little while. Although the marines can go around from ways of cycling. And uh, Aladufe just uh, engaging no name here. He's just delaying for time. Uh, but actually buys his command a bit of time to expand. He doesn't get the kill, and I don't think he got the parasite. Oh, maybe he did actually. Yeah, he did. So Zero Master's just sneaking around right now. One gap also sneaking around. He's anticipating that some skulls are going to come in and engage. Um, so now we're seeing a three man push down to repairs. They're going to get Sati down. They're literally sitting on four RTs right now. They could probably get a fifth one up. Uh, but they were. Wasting a lot of time just trying to get these kills, which, in my opinion, is not the best way to do. They want that to be higher, especially when fades. Stuff come up. Um, see they can't even get the tech for them. Two Marines here in gravity hold against three aliens. They do get one kill. Can they make it two? Oh, long gap. He, do he does get the rifle bar kill on El Dufo there. Don't see too many of them anymore. Yeah, I know. I realise my uh, volume is quite low. I'm not down. Okay, so game volume turned down a bit. Hopefully, that's a bit better. So we're seeing Soma here just harassing uh, supply lines. He's probably going to get that down. Oh no! He's gonna stay on it. He's going to get trapped from both sides now. So the best he can do is try and parasite. Uh, just get that RT as low as possible. We see Zero Master taking down one gap there on gravity just as he rebuilds that RT. Oh, they didn't even build it. 94%. Uh, no name, just taking down Leon. Two Marines pushing towards Baywing now. They're going to try and get this RT up. Alien's actually on five RTs right now. That's a really good uh, point. For them. They're going to get these phase up really soon if they can keep this up. Not seeing any pressure at all really from the Marines right now. Uh, they are trying to get Baywing, but already the aliens are there. Then we've got the Lou as the Lurk. He is already low though. Could get taken out if he gets trapped. Uh, but he does make it out of there. Free spurs completed already. They went for a shift type. So most of them would be running with celerity right now, including the Lurk. Uh, <laughs> the Lurk go for a Dren. Best of choice. You don't see many go for a Dren. Most go with celerity. Uh, he's just running away, so that's a bit boring. So how do they defend Swiss Path here? Gorge and Skull against one lone Marine. They really need to help each other out now. Healing that skull can get that marine down. Oh man, not a good situation with Swiss Pad. He could get taken out, but Vindaloo's in from behind. He should get him down. There we go. Takes a lot of damage though, Vindaloo. He could go down here. He's got to play this safe, and he does go down. He's playing very risky. He needs to use those corners better. Uh, to his effect. We've seen early phase gates again. Same marine, marine strap from O Victory as on fire did. Very interesting. 
Uh, oh, and we do see a phase gate in uh, Electrical Core 2. So that's two phase gates up already. That's going to put them in a pretty good position. And they have lost their Lurk already. So they're going to struggle right now. But they are still on 5RT, so Phage will be coming up very quickly. Um, the way Ovidri are playing right now, they haven't really got any res down. So we're going to see Fades in, let's see, 5RTs. It will be in the next minute, yeah. In fact, less than that. In the next half minute. Lufo does get taken down there. Uh, in fact, <laughs> although a victory hasn't been getting any alien RTs down, uh, the same can be said for on fire. I think they've only actually got one down. Let's have a look. Q doesn't work anymore. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, I changed my, my mind. So they lost three. So okay, they've done alright. We've seen a big engagement here in the uh, Krevi. Three Marines, one does get taken down. Swiss Pav all in his own, but he does manage to escape. Aladufa coming from behind. They're just going to wait for some backup right now. That Gorge can be a really powerful asset in these big engagements, but I feel like they're not really using him that well. Um, and the Marines do match the whole gravity, which is really, really well played by them. And they're sitting on 5RTs right now, so that's going to allow them to take up radical things. Um, look how much res uh, on fire on. They could drop this hive very, very easily right now. They just need to have some presence and parasites so they can see what's going on all around the map. So, we're just seeing the uh, supply lines going down now. On fire, desperately trying to get. Oh, we're seeing fades up now. Here we go. Uh, so, Zero Master. Soma and Aladufo, they're the free fades. They can't get any more fades up until uh, Nidalu or Swiss Pav has enough res. Because obviously Swiss Pav's gorge and Nidalu lost his lurk. So let's get a bit of first person. Zero is quite good. Let's see what he's like as an alien. I've really checked him out. I want to see some nice engagements here. What's he going for? He's going for a drone as well. Uh, looks like this plug wall with the hydrogen is doing a pretty good job. Drop fire. Not getting many hits here, Zero Master. He's the same, maybe. One here, going one here. It does take quite a big chunk of his health, though. And they do manage to, uh, looks like they've managed to take gravity. Oh, they do take quite a bit. Oh, and three, three Marines phasing through at the same time there. Vindaloo does go down, he's only a Skulker. Phase playing pr pretty careful, which is good, that's what they need to do. And Swiss Pav, still alive as Gorge. He lost one already, though. In fact, no, he didn't. He kept his cordial light. Um, wow, Marines actually managed to hold gravity. Quite surprising. I, I thought, how far we're going to take that? Although, yeah, okay, they can play a couple more shotguns. They'll be alright. P res isn't looking too great for them, but they're still on five RTs. We're not seeing any RT harassment anywhere. On that oh, and Soma taking quite a big, big shot there. Four Marines. You know, you don't want five Marines. In fact, you don't want to be going into that as a phase. I'll tell you now. And three Marines going through to electrical core. Uh, let's see. Let's see how good these marines are. Respect. Maybe. Build structure and waypoint. Let's see some kills, man. Oh, we're seeing a whip crack uh, going on here. In uh, in X, and we do see the the hive going up in waste cycling at the same time. So I'd imagine they'd probably go for a shade hive, but you never know. I don't know what their tactics are. Oh, and so we're seeing three marines here again in gravity. Oh, and then down. He was my, he was my man. I was going to spec him. Oh, they did a pretty good job those fades. Well done, well played. Um, bio bomb up as well. So that's going to go down now. Uh, there's not much support though, so they they will respawn and be able to get through. Now they'll do for all of them. So you could actually get trapped right now with all these marines fades through. Look how low his health is. He needs to get out of there. And Soma. Oh wow. All that all that needed is one big uh, shotgun shot, and he would have gone down. Pretty risky play there. But uh, it seems like these guys aren't too great shots, or well, maybe it's just the pings, I don't know. Uh, electrical core seems pretty safe right now. I think that's just a skull harassing. They really need to get some more res down though. Oh, uh, big engagements here. No shotguns on. Oh, yeah, so sneaking around the corner there. Jumping around these uh, shotguns. Two of 
I feel like most players just instinctively just jump every time they shoot. Many meat chunk shots there. His fade is playing pretty well. Steps over. Yeah, kill on Mungat there. Playing pretty well. Three Marines though. One century as well. So pretty low there. He's escaping those. They've got the cracking girl, which is a really nice placement actually. This allows them to keep going in now. Look at Abdi for the kind of low here as well. Zero. He's playing with alien vision on. I tend not to. I don't really like it, but it can. It can work. So the power does actually go down in gravity, but they have got the sentry battery there still, which will still shoot because obviously it's a battery that's not powered by the power. Uh, big engagement here though. Soma so low he could go down. Oh, I'm surprised he didn't die there. Wow, that could have been their saving grace. So they're going to rebuild that power. They need more people here though, and they do have two more coming in from Blockload. Marmory is just going to sit by uh, electric recorders to defend that. Uh, that crag though, with wow, four whips and a shift, five whips in fact. That's they're not going to take that down anytime soon unless they get flames, GLs, or arcs. Um, so I can see gravity going down again very soon. Clove's getting taken out now. Zero now. So let's see. Um, okay, so he seems to be focusing more on his dodging than he is his hitting. Uh, Free marine still in gravity though. Not really achieved much there. I think uh, who's the gorge? Swiss path. Yeah, he's still alive, he's doing fine. So that's gonna really help them in these big big engagements, because you know, fades are quite easy to hit now, and I think they're all actually using adrenaline. Fur rather, it's uh slowly. It's uh down to preference. Uh nice echoing of the whip there as well. It's gonna do a lot of uh, damage and harassment. Oh two whips as well. And is that coming from here? Yeah it is. He's sh he's shifting them echoing them into the uh, the shift us by X. Since Zero Master, he's actually pretty low on energy, even though he's got a drone. That's the problem with a drone, you need to use a hell of a lot of energy to, uh, just to get up to a suitable speed, I feel. Uh, still three Marines here in uh, Gravity, in uh, Electric Corn. Zero Master does go down! Poor guy. Uh, but the phase gate goes down too, which was such a trade off, but, you know, that's good. Works well for the alien, so 615 RT still. They're going to hope to expand down this way as well, so they can get a third hive, I imagine. Um, same pretty low, you know, where's the rest of the team? What's going down? I don't really know. Uh, so the shotguns are, you know, they're, they're pretty good at getting these skulks down, and they have got a fade down already, which is really good for them. Still sitting on 4RTs as well, just allowing them to keep taking off. Even if they keep losing their phase gates. Um, you know, oh, so much! Look how low he is! Wow, what's that like? 24 HP. Oh man, what is he doing? Unbelievable! He just got trapped there. I thought he was just going to escape for the vent or something. Uh, he spent way too long there. So that's two phase down. I can see our victory coming back from this. This could be their first win. Uh, oh, then move does go down again as a lurk. Now we just got whips. You know, they're actually really good. They do a hell of a lot of damage against structures with that uh, bombard. And we've got the shift here. He's gonna, he's gonna use that shift to get these whips out of here if he needs to. This is just a lone marine all on his own, so he's actually not gonna be able to get anything down. Uh, down. Yeah, and Zero Master does get the kill on him. We're just seeing Spirons go down from Swiss Perps, so they're now sitting on. Well, they will be sitting on 4RTs once repairs built. Still 5RTs from fire, and uh, well, they went for Crag Hive, so they've got Carapace, I imagine, on their fades. Let's have a look. Oh, they don't have any fades left, in fact. So I can't remember that. Um, but yeah, those Smaggles did a really good job with those whips actually. Really nice support for his team there. And, um, yeah, that shift's really helping to you know, keep the energy and echo those whips in. He's actually got a shift in uh, electrical core as well now, I think. I can't see that. It's actually really dark for me as well. Let's have a look. Let's have a little look around here. I don't know where I am right now. Yeah, yeah he's got a shift in here as well. So that's they're gonna expand that. Way. Now they're gonna uh Victory gonna try and get a phase gate Bayman uh, There's actually quite a lot of marines out of position, so if I could base rush right now or we'll get this phase gate down in gravity. Although the sentry is gonna prove to be a bit of a problem, but yeah, they can get behind that sentry battery without getting shot. So that's good. Um, uh, okay, so no phase gate or okay, they're not getting phase gate. 
They're only on three RTs right now, so probably not the best time to be pushing either. Uh, and we do see the phase gate going down as well. Power's going down too, so this is looks like it's going to seal on fire's win actually. It's just a bit of a shame because uh, yeah, sorry about the sound. A bit of a shame because uh, Overtree looking quite strong just then. They're going to win, although they're not out of the game just yet. No fades up, and well, fades are going to be up again pretty soon. Then Luke going fade, and Luke going fade. Oh, we could see Odin's actually. Snowgo again, getting another whip kill. There's no way in hell a low marine is getting to. Uh... Actually, there's no whips here anymore. Interesting. Oh, there's a one whip. But still, uh, a low marine is not going to get in anywhere at this point, I don't think. And they need to go together as a big group. Um, I'm not really sure what they're doing right now. They need to retake a phase gate position, um, and they're not doing that. So, I'm not sure what the plan is right now. Maybe just get some more res up. Uh, gravity seems to be untouched. I'd like to see. Oh, okay, yeah, so Smaragor is expanding into Gravity with Sis right now. Um, probably just going to use it to get, to get some whips in here with, uh, with his Echo. So we're seeing Aladufo as the next fade, so he's the first fade back up. Currently only has Carab. Oh! Yeah, no, he only has a Drench. So Oh, it's actually pretty low. Wow, that's what happens when you get weapons to maybe weapons free now. Yeah, weapons free now. So LMGs can just take a fade down, no problem with weapons free. Uh, so we're seeing a phase gate here in electrical or just outside of it. It's actually quite a nice position because it traps the fades because it's such a tight area. So any fades that come into here, it's actually quite easy for the marines to defend because the fades don't have so much movement in such a tight area. Like that. Uh, but we're seeing actually a five-man push into electrical core, so... Oh, and we do see... Gravity up as well. So I don't know why I didn't notice that. But, um... That's actually pretty good for the They're gonna hopefully... Keep taking up. Uh, and just keep this res high. That's all they need to do. And then, you know, they can go for uh, arcs or jetpacks, whatever they're going for. I don't really know. Exos maybe, but... Well, okay, a couple of them are quite high res, so they could get exos. Yeah, they're going to sit on 5 res now, which is actually really good for marines, but at the same time, it's not good to keep aliens on 5 res. Uh, aliens actually benefit from having uh, the same amount of res more than the marines do, I feel. Uh, also, because they can get around the map a lot easier, so they can defend far as We've seen our first Onus as well, in the form of Swiss Path. So, where are they going? Are they going for base? They're going for base, yeah. So that's a full 5 man push into base, with a drifter as well. So we're seeing a Lurk for Umbra and Onus. Fade and is that two gorgeous? One goes straight down there. Wow. Uh, probably should just grind the power right now. There's only two marines up. Uh, Fade can deal with that while the Onus grinds the power, but no. Fade not to do that. Fade gate is down though, but there's a beacon. But most of the marine team are dead. So, yeah, that's pretty much a good game at this point. There's only one IP as well. Blades to throw on fire, that's 4 0. So, uh, yeah, sorry, we only actually caught two games. Um, I was out shopping when these guys asked me to cast. Um, I didn't actually have this plan to cast this, so uh, sorry about that. But maybe, in fact, no, there was no other cast. Unfortunately, we missed the first two rounds completely. So I can't tell you what happened now. But anyway, I should be casting some more games at some point, I don't know when because I'm also playing competitive games as well, PCWs, so my schedule's a bit tight for casting at this point, but I will get some more in at some point anyway. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching. See you later.